okay uh, today we'll show you uh, how to add a digital product uh, or the downloadable product in the magento using magento marketplace module as uh, magento marketplace module support all type of magento product like simple product downloadable product virtual product configurable product bundle product and group product so um, today i will show you how you can uh, open your digital marketplace kind of like you can open your ebook marketplace or book marketplace you can sell your music uh, you can open your video marketplace you can open your software marketplace uh, using this wonderful magento marketplace multi vendor module so what you need to do means after the installation you can check all the installation and everything in the documentation of the module um, as then you will click on document uh, button right here you will see the link uh, webcool.com slash blog magento multi seller marketplace so what you need to do after the purchase of the module you will get app and skin folder you need to just move your app and skin folder into the your magento root and it will be installed properly and uh, after that um, you need to do and you need to set up the demo you need to set up the configuration file of the um, configurations of the magento marketplace so this is the standard configuration what you need to do you need to go to the system configuration and when you will click on the system and configuration part you will see the complete um, configuration panel of the magento marketplace module so um, for the downloadable product or the digital product what you the most important the most important part is like um, uh, you need to choose what sample file you want to allow like it's a default one in the admin and what should be the file type okay so if suppose that if you want to allow only a digital uh, means allow vendor to upload only digital product in that case you need to use this downloadable one you need to select this downloadable option only okay so after the setting and everything and this um, what you need to do after the set it up you need to go to the my account area of the of the magento and when you will log in into the system uh, you will see uh, on the left hand side there's a marketplace block and you can see under new product right here you can choose your attribute set and default and product type so let's say I'm just checking this default one and because I need to open a digital marketplace so I will choose downloadable one so I choose this downloadable option and then I continue and as you can see this is the seller panel by which a vendor can upload their digital product so let me show you how it will work suppose that you want to sell the ebooks so what I will I'm just adding a product ebook testing I just choose a category you can choose multiple category from the tree menu but anyways I'm just going to means you can see here right here it's beautiful it's like tree expandable menu and I'm just saving the description this is what you see what you get editor and let's say SKU is EB testing, ebook testing, and you can see it will directly check uh, from the database that if the SKU is available or not. If it's not available, you need to change the SKU. And then the price, let's say it's a forty-five dollars special price. I don't want to put a special price thing. And you can set the special price. But suppose that if you want to put a special price from date you can see right here there's a beautiful calendar you can pick means from how many days it will be available 
and then you need to choose tax class it's like um, the complete admin panel of the magento is at the seller side so for the complete catalog management so i'm just going to add some images let's say i just add an image mm. let's say i just add an image marketplace a market add one and then then again market add two and i just put it as a base image and then you can see this is the downloadable product option right here so you can upload like ebook testing and i can put something like ebook test file and the price is 89 i can put anything if you can you want you can put it like blank as well so i just i'm just going to add a simplify I just choose this one see as you can see as a PDF say and here it is and I'm just going to add this webcool.j okay so we are ready to go and now we are going to save it and as you can see your product has been successfully saved you can check your product under the my product list and you can see there's a good number of um so if, and you can see there's a the ebook testing right you can see the ebook testing you want to suppose that you want to edit it then you can edit the product as well okay so this is the all the setting which we have saved and uh, i just logged in into the admin section and you can see there's the ebook testing the product which i have added from the front end you can see the price and everything is right there and all the information which we have saved like SKU um, you can check the downloadable information and you can see right here the PDF file which I have saved and the downloadable one okay so let's test it out at the front end how it works you can see like all the images there which we have uploaded and everything is there you can check the prices and the stock option which we have added and we can check the categories part as well the ebook part which we have selected so it's very easy to add um, your downloadable product from the magenta store and that you can um open the digital marketplace within the minutes so this is the complete um setup of how to add a digital product in magento marketplace and if you have any query or any question just uh, drop us an email or just create a ticket at webcool.com slash ticket and we will check this out for any issue or any query. Thanks for watching.